The Narcissist's Apology After You Discover All Their Lies It's baffling how narcissists can coerce their victims into suffering unspeakable torment at their hands. Those who commit such atrocities and show no remorse are deeply disturbed, and it's difficult to understand how they can go about their days unpunished with poisonous ideas propagating. Don't they realize that their behavior impacts other people? What else, though, is going to happen if they aren't ready? Here's the thing. Narcissists are well aware of the suffering they bring to others, and they meticulously plot out how to inflict it. They know exactly how you feel and can relate to what you're going through. However, individuals can easily avoid the feeling by just refusing to acknowledge it. Without the ability to empathize, they cannot understand your situation. Their inability to feel sympathy for others limits their ability to connect with others. They have no compassion and don't mind causing harm. Narcissists have a hard time understanding why their behavior is wrong or why they should be punished. Since you are an impediment to the narcissist's progress, they will bring you harm. Where do you turn when you have evidence but no one to pin it on? They have no regrets or shame over their behavior, so what can be done? The fact that they initially didn't care raises red flags. They can either keep doing business as usual while downplaying its significance, or they can sever all relations with it in order to wash their hands of the situation. Narcissists can be recognized by the way they deal with their own failures and setbacks in the past. Though narcissists rarely feel regret for the pain they cause, it is well known that they will go to tremendous lengths to avoid others accusing them. This is why narcissists never show true contrition for their actions. If they receive negative feedback, narcissists will use it to justify one of the following. Remember that they are always on the lookout for justifications for their actions. Narcissists often think that their victims deserve to be treated badly because they provoked such reactions from them. Because of this, narcissists often get paranoid and start to fear for their lives. It can also be used to justify their actions or safeguards. Third, narcissists have a tendency to downplay the seriousness of the repercussions of their acts when they are made fully aware of them. Narcissists have a tendency to take things personally, even if the other person didn't intend any damage. In all likelihood, their scathing or angry comments, which they dress up in a veneer of black humor, are taken entirely seriously. However, this is how they really feel, and they want for the other person to know that this is the case. Narcissists are confident in their own superiority and will assume the blame if you challenge them. Such boasts are common tactics used by narcissists, and you can fall for them if you're not careful. They plan to torment their victims horribly and then bury them all together. Last but not least, narcissists often utilize selective amnesia to make you feel they have forgotten the horrific things they have done. Individuals with a high narcissistic personality trait tend to be extremely self-absorbed and fixated on exonerating themselves from responsibility for their own actions. If a narcissist is insulted or hurt, they are unlikely to forgive and forget. By playing the victim card, they absolve themselves of responsibility for their behavior. For narcissists, remembering the truth might be challenging since they have spent so much time distorting or burying their memories, so that you give up and forget about everything. They want you to believe this. They intentionally falsify their actions when something goes wrong in order to hide their tracks. Narcissists employ this tactic to downplay the seriousness of their errors. They try to justify their behavior by downplaying or ignoring its consequences. Rather than take responsibility, they find someone or something else to blame. They don't want to own up to their actions. They will place the blame on others rather than themselves. They do not harbor any remorse. Narcissists who are insensitive to the pain they inflict others frequently apologize in this way. If you subscribe to this kind of thinking, the narcissist will be relieved when you stop bringing them up in your complaints. It's possible they're trying to shift the blame by apologizing rather than taking responsibility for their actions. Furthermore, after you stop following them, they will go back to being themselves. This proposal must be stopped immediately. They need to pay if they keep passing the buck. Keep an eye out for folks who try to deny or overstate the harm they've caused. You run the risk of sliding back into their trap if you don't. Those who disagree with the narcissist's techniques will suffer more consequences.
If we don't publicly disagree with their excuses now, nobody will ever learn not to trust them. Do not expect an apology from a narcissist, as they are highly unlikely to offer one. Because of their excessive pride, they think they are infallible. As they see themselves as above the law, they are unconcerned about the consequences of their actions. Don't give them any room to maneuver. However, I think it sums up all I have to say in this video. Feel free to talk about the times when other people tried to justify or defend their bad behavior. I appreciate you, everyone taking the time to be here today very much. I appreciate it.